Okay, so you might not recognize me, so, but I'm Coolstar. I'm a member of Hashbang, and I believe that users should have the choice to do what they want with their devices. So a jailbroken device should be customizable how they like it. So like if I want the iOS 6 UI back, I should be able to have that. Also, for developers, they should be able to develop from the platform of their choice. So, I actually wanted to get into development back in late 2011. However, there wasn't much documentation about developing without a Mac. So, Macs unfortunately cost about three times that of an average PC. I finally discovered install SDK 3 and install Theos 3, but those are iOS 3 SDK things. So this is about the state of development without OS X today. So the latest open source toolchain is now available for Windows, iOS, and Linux. It supports the latest 7.1 SDK, and you can build iOS 7 compatible tweaks for the iPhones 2G up to the iPhone 5. And ARM64 support will come soon, as soon as Apple open sources their linker. So, didn't expect this, right? Theos, running on Windows. And here are some recommended programs for development. All of these are, are cross-platform. So Sublime Text, it allows you to syntax highlight your Objective-C. Class Dump Z actually has a Windows version. It's a little bit older, but it works perfectly fine. And the demo version of IDA is also cross-platform. You can use this to disassemble anything you need to. And here's some good online resources. So there's an excellent shared instance post for those on Windows who would like to set up Theos and the Toolchain. And on IRC, there's a Theos channel. And you can use a client like Quasel to access the IRC network. And then, last but not least, the iPhone Dev Wiki. And although most of it is currently centered on Mac, like it's getting like more cross-platform because I've been editing quite a lot on it. So if you don't have a Mac, no worries. You can develop for iOS today.